St. Francis Church was demolished. And prior to its being demolished, we removed all the pews and uh, put them on eBay. And I got a call from a, uh, a pastor in Louisiana uh, saying that their church had been destroyed by hurricanes twice in a row. Uh, the last one was Hurricane Ike and that they have no pews. They're using folding chairs and they want to purchase our, uh, our pews. And I presented the proposal to the implementation committee that we have in the parish and they unanimously agreed without even thinking about it that we should not sell them to them but donate them to them. We thought it would be a nice gesture uh, out of our loss, so to speak, from, of the church that someone else will benefit from it. And uh, they, they like the idea of uh, they're being used in another Catholic church and continue to be uh, used for worship, Catholic worship. What brought you ladies out this morning uh, to uh, watch them load the pews? To say goodbye to our pews. And how long have each of you been members of the church? All our lives. All our lives. Um, now I understand these pews are going to a church down in Louisiana somewhere? Yes. How does that make you feel that, you know, they're going to find a home in a new church? I'm thrilled. I'm thrilled that they're going to be used in a church. The people of, uh, <clears throat> of, the, of the area, particularly the prisoners of St. Francis, were are very hurt and about not only their church closing but also being demolished <clears throat> which was a double hurt and the fact that these pews are now going to be used uh, by another Catholic church and that out of their loss comes somebody else's hope and their it, it made it's making the whole process a lot easier I think you know to know that I knew it was going to go someplace that it's beef or stuff and I, I just figure someplace in the country. I knew it was going to be far away because there's a lot of churches around, but they're scattered. And I'm very happy it's going to good use. Ready, gentlemen? Yes, sir.